The world of gold mining, with its intense pressures and high stakes, is fertile ground for complex relationships, particularly among its most visible participants. This dynamic is exemplified in the complicated relationship between Parker Schnabel and Rick Ness, two of the most celebrated personalities on the show. The recent revelations by Parker about his evolving relationship with Rick have sparked significant interest and speculation among fans. Rick Ness's decision to leave Parker's team to strike out on his own was a watershed moment for both men. Rick, who had risen through the ranks to become Parker's foreman and trusted lieutenant, had become integral to the team's operations. However, the pressures of mining and the relentless pursuit of gold began to erode their once solid friendship, replacing camaraderie with a business-like formality and, at times, palpable tension. Despite this, in a rare candid disclosure to fans during an episode of The Dirt, Rick shed light on the nuances of his relationship with Parker. He admitted that their split was marked by feelings of dissatisfaction and some residual animosity. Nevertheless, he was optimistic about their current standing, suggesting that time had healed the initial wounds. Looking back, there were tensions, Rick acknowledged, but I believe we've moved beyond that now. This sentiment was underscored by an incident recalled by Rick, where during a panel discussion with other mining bosses, Parker came to his defense in a misunderstanding. This gesture, seemingly small, indicated a pivotal shift towards mutual understanding and respect, hinting at a mending of fences between the two. The personal reconciliation between Parker and Rick was further evidenced during a joint trip to New York. Away from the mines and the relentless pressure of gold digging, the pair rediscovered some of their old rapport. It felt like old times, and it reminded us of the bond we've had, Rick shared, highlighting the contrast between their professional conflicts and personal relationship. Professionally, Parker has been open about the challenges Rick's departure posed to his team. He described the subsequent season as one of the toughest, with Rick's exit creating a leadership vacuum and stirring operational challenges. Losing Rick was hard. He was more than a foreman, he was a pillar of our team, Parker explained in an interview. Despite these difficulties, Parker's respect for Rick's decision remains unshaken, and he has expressed appreciation for Rick's transparency about his departure. As competitors, Parker and Rick now find themselves in a novel situation. While they are no longer collaborating towards a common goal, their paths continue to intersect in the close-knit world of gold mining. Parker made it clear that he harbors no ill feelings towards Rick. We are competitors, but that doesn't erase our history or the respect I have for him, he stated during a reflective moment on the show. Their enduring friendship was put on display in season 14 when Rick, after a year's absence, returned to seek Parker's assistance. This reunion, while professional in nature, was laced with personal undertones and demonstrated the complex layers of their relationship. Parker did not hesitate to lend a hand, underscoring their ongoing friendship despite their professional rivalry. In summary, the relationship between Parker Schnabel and Rick Ness encapsulates the highs and lows of life in the limelight and the brutal business of gold mining. Their story is one of friendship, rivalry, and mutual respect, a dynamic narrative that continues to captivate the audience of Gold Rush. As their journey unfolds, both on and off the screen, it serves as a poignant reminder of the enduring human elements amidst the clatter of machinery and the lust for gold. Friendships at work can significantly enhance job satisfaction and create a positive work environment. However, when these friendships evolve into rivalries due to professional competition or career advancements, the dynamics can become complex and challenging. Drawing insights from notable examples like Parker Schnabel and Rick Ness from the reality TV show Gold Rush, this article explores the intricacies of workplace relationships when friends turn into competitors. Workplace friendships often form out of necessity, shared goals, or through the camaraderie that comes from facing daily challenges together. These relationships can provide emotional and professional support, boosting morale and fostering a collaborative environment. However, these same factors can complicate relationships when the context shifts from cooperative to competitive. Transition from collaboration to competition. As seen in the case of Parker and Rick, 
A significant change in one party's career path, such as a promotion, a switch to a rival company, or starting a competing business, can test the strength and resilience of a workplace friendship. This transition often introduces elements of rivalry, especially if both parties find themselves competing for the same resources, recognition, or success. Parker Schnabel and Rick Ness, prominent figures on the reality TV show Gold Rush, exemplify this complexity through their evolving relationship, which has transitioned from close friendship to professional rivalry. Rick Ness initially joined Parker Schnabel's crew as a right-hand man and quickly became integral to the team's success. Under Parker's mentorship, Rick grew into his role as foreman, learning the ropes of high-stakes gold mining. This period marked the peak of their camaraderie, characterized by mutual respect and shared goals. However, as Rick grew more competent and confident, he made a bold decision to leave Parker's team and start his own mining operation. This shift from being teammates to competitors introduced new dynamics into their relationship. While such a move could easily sour a friendship, the situation between Parker and Rick, as revealed through various interviews and show episodes, is more nuanced. Although Rick's departure created operational challenges for Parker's team, it also marked a maturation in their relationship from being merely friends to respecting each other as business equals. Despite the potential for conflict, Parker and Rick have managed to maintain a level of respect and professionalism. Insights from behind-the-scenes interactions, especially those shared during special episodes like The Dirt, suggest that any initial bitterness has largely dissipated. A notable incident where Parker defended Rick during a panel discussion underscores a pivotal shift towards understanding and mutual respect. Their personal relationship, too, appears to be on the mend. Instances like their joint visit to New York post-departure have allowed them to reconnect, reminiscing about past camaraderies and perhaps laying the groundwork for a renewed friendship, albeit within the new context of their professional rivalry. Professionally, Rick's departure undoubtedly left a void in Parker's team, affecting its structure and dynamics. Parker himself has spoken about the challenges of filling the leadership gap left by Rick and adjusting to the new normal. However, these challenges have also propelled Parker to push his limits and adapt, which is essential for survival in the competitive world of gold mining. On the other hand, Rick's new venture is a testament to his growth and the skills he honed while working with Parker. His decision to leave was not just a step towards independence but also a move to establish himself as a formidable player in the mining field. Despite their professional paths diverging, Parker and Rick's interactions in subsequent seasons of Gold Rush show that they have managed to maintain a functional and respectful relationship. They have demonstrated that it is possible to compete fiercely in the professional arena while retaining a personal relationship characterized by respect and occasional collaboration. The relationship between Parker Schnabel and Rick Ness is a compelling study of how professional pressures can transform personal relationships, often leading them into complex but mature directions. Their journey from close friends to competitors, and the continued respect and occasional camaraderie they share, reflects the multifaceted nature of human relationships, particularly in high-pressure environments like gold mining. As they continue to navigate their intertwined paths, the evolving dynamics between Parker and Rick remain a central narrative, enriching the backdrop of Gold Rush with a deeply human element. The story of Parker and Rick demonstrates that it's possible to maintain a form of friendship despite evolving into rivals. They manage to retain a respect for each other's capabilities and even support one another when needed. This shows that with maturity and understanding, it's possible to transform a potentially negative rivalry into a respectful competitive relationship that can drive both parties to greater heights. Workplace rivalries between friends are a delicate matter, requiring careful navigation and emotional intelligence. By maintaining professionalism, setting clear boundaries, and keeping communication lines open, it is possible to manage these relationships effectively. Ultimately, how these dynamics are handled can define both the personal growth of the individuals involved and the overall culture of the workplace.